And after the latest few Fortnite updates, I noticed there's a lot of additional input delay guys. So therefore I'm going to show you the best ways to counter this and really make sure that you have zero delay while playing arena or creative so that you can perform to your fullest potential. And if you guys enjoyed this content, please don't forget to leave a like and now let's get straight into this topic. And the package guys, which we're gonna be utilizing in today's video is gonna be called less input delay season four pack. And you can basically get it on my website guys. Just simply join onto the first link in the description. And then here under input delay, you're going to click onto it and get redirected and there you should find it. Then just simply click on the post itself and you can scroll down until you can find the download button which is going to redirect it to google drive from where you can download it once we get it on our pc guys we're going to open it up and extract all of the files here onto our desktop and as you can see already we have first of all limit diagnostics log collection guys and this basically means all the measurements or basically like data collecting on your pc is going to get fully disabled guys therefore just simply click here onto limit diagnostics log collection and make sure that you actually click onto disable you of course also have the option to enable it again if you should need it whatsoever guys so yeah you usually don't need it so therefore just disable it click onto yes and then it's already applied to your pc then we're gonna go here next up hardware acceleration guys which you're gonna make sure to put a hundred percent sent on to enable guys here this is super important because this one is going to give you less latency it's basically like an intern mode of windows which is going to make sure that you get the least amount of delay possibly from your pc just simply make sure that it's actually enabled here real quick then we of course also have disable widgets in windows and we're going to open this up here and as you can see here on my windows version i have no widgets whatsoever you know like all these small animations or extra features on your windows which you don't need because yeah they're just slowing down your pc so therefore we're going to click onto widgets disable Click onto yes again, guys, and then it's already fully disabled here on our PC. And for the final step, we now have here disable background apps in Windows 11. It works exactly the same way for Windows 10 as well, guys. So therefore, don't be worried there. And then you can see a background applications, Windows 11 disable. We're going to select this one, click onto yes. And most of the background apps which are running here 24 seven on our Windows PC are gonna get stopped, guys. And then we're already done here with these steps. And now let's continue with the next one. And for this next step, guys, you gotta join onto my Discord. And then we're going to use a tool which is gonna be called timer resolution. And what you want to do is specifically get the one here from my Discord where it already says here X config because that's super important. If you can find it, just simply go into the search bar, type in timer, and then you should find it. Timer set resolution from here can also straight up download it. And once you get it on your PC, we're going to launch the program itself. And you can already see here now that we have here now a minimum resolution and our current resolution. And once we click onto maximum, we actually reduce our input delay guys by 50%. Yeah, we don't have one millisecond now. We have 0.5 milliseconds, which is amazing. And if it for you shouldn't say 0 0.500 but something else like 0 0.499 this is exactly now where the rest of the packs comes in clutch guys because we have cmd comments in here where we're just simply going to open up our cmd prompt as an administrator launch it real quick and what you guys want to do is make sure to copy all three of these comments into the cmd one by one click onto yes and then it's going to get applied after that you can close this now relaunch the program actually itself which i'm going to do here in the background as well real quick and then once you click onto maximum it should be on 0 0.500 and you're going to let this run in the background every time you hop into Fortnite. Tfue was literally using this program at some point. Canada was still like some of the top performers in NA East, guys. So therefore, you can't get banned for it. So therefore, you're just gonna let it run in the background. And with that said, guys, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.